What's up guys, it's Raf in the Raf Cave and welcome back to another unboxing. Now this here is the ultimate of Yeti microphones that just came out. Searching my phone, saw a notification of Yeti X. This is brand new from them. Uh, this is going to be the ultimate in microphone USB tech for them. This one here, four capsules inside. That's one extra than the Blue Yeti their most popular uh, microphone. Now this has four microphones inside this thing to capture even greater performance of your voice for streaming and you know podcasting and gaming, all stuff. And this has the four different zones of recording, right? Straight at you, front and back, stereo, and omnidirectional of everything. This has got all that. Plus it's got an LED indicator on the actual volume knob. So you know exactly how loud your voice is by just looking at the microphone. Really cool. And it's got a uh, headphone volume control and a mixer between the, the game volume and the, uh, the, uh, the mic volume. So that way it's a nice balance, which is great about this too. It's got buttons for switching the different sound fields versus the little knob. And it's got a, a mute button by just clicking the, uh, the uh, volume control. So this thing is badass. It's all black, which I like. Now, if you guys noticed, I don't have a microphone right now. Um, brought back the uh, HyperX Quadcast. So check out my, my uh, unboxing of the, and video of that. And also, if you want to hear my voice with that microphone, you can check my live streams from before and some of my reactions. Uh, that was a great microphone. Uh, the only thing I didn't really like was the actual red LED light. When I was doing my videos with my green screen, um, the red was kind of clashing, so I didn't really like the color it was uh, uh, portraying in my videos. Um, and Yeti is definitely a little more professional. Um, what's unique about this one is this is 24-bit uh, audio performance versus I think it was 16 from the previous microphone. So this one captures your voice much, much more clear. And I'm all about better audio performance when I'm streaming and reactions and unboxing videos. So guys, check this one out, Yeti X. Um, Best Buy's got this bad boy. Amazon's got it. Uh, retails at 169, and uh, it's pretty bad, pretty damn cool looking. So, yeah, let's get this guy unboxed. Welcome to the, welcome to the uh, the video. I'm Raf. Home theater inspiration videos, unboxings, trailer reactions, all kinds of cool stuff. If you like that stuff, smash the like, hit the bell so you know when the next video comes out, and subscribe if you're new. Welcome to Raf Cave Club. Hit that like button. Appreciate it. Without further ado, let's get this unboxed. All right, guys, here is the box. There's your front, there's your side, there's your back, there's the other side right there. All right, let's get this unboxed. You know what the time it is, guys. Black pin. Looks like we got just a piece of tape right here. Boom. So I'm gonna pull this out this way. Oh, we got another nice tape here. One more time. Whoa. All right, check this out, guys. A few little pieces of paper here. Important information, safety stuff. Yeah, yeah. All right, so here is the paper here. Now, what it's going to tell you is you have your gain adjustment. So when you just turn it, you know, left and right, that's how much gain you want. The little LED indicators tell you what your current voice is going to be when you're uh, speaking. And if you hold it down for a second, it'll switch over to the headphone side. Then you can adjust the volume of the headphone level. Hold it for another second. That's the blend of the uh, your chat and your... Um, Headphones. Metering, so it tells you that the green is good, anything in the red X is bad, too much. Your mute, you just press it in once. On the back of the mic, the, the microphone is gonna be that button. You switch between the different modes. W and the cutter mode, mostly. Then you got your 3.5 millimeter on the bottom, and then your micro USB, and then your uh, standard uh, mount. And of course it comes with its own table mount as well. Pretty cool. Take out this foam little pad here. Very nice. 
Let's take this uh, little cable out. This would be your micro USB cable. I'm guessing it's probably gonna be about six feet or so. Mm -hmm. Yep, six feeter, six footer, yep. Six footer cord and then the main event. This is sexy, all black, beautiful. Okay, get the grooves in there, perfect. That's where my uh, mount will go into. Like a USB there, nice little button, nice knob, the back, push the button, LED light, will light up there. Very nice, I like the look of this, very clean. It's a heavy stand too, guys. That's a serious, serious weight. Got a nice pad on the bottom for your table. Rest that on there, got the tightening there. So I'm gonna take this off because uh, I'm gonna put this on my mount. Nothing else in the box. All right, I'll show a few picture, pictures of it, front and back, and then I'm gonna get it installed on my headphone stand. Be right back. All right guys, so I'm back here. Now I did take the microphone off of the base. This is what the base looks like without the mic. Pretty sturdy, pretty strong, pretty heavy. Don't need it because I got this arm right here next to me, which is awesome. Now, uh, as you can hear my voice, I'm speaking now like normal. Um, before I was on my little phone microphone, so hopefully you guys hear a difference in the quality of my voice. Uh, right now, we're going to go check out the website of the uh, the Yeti X, and then I'm going to show you the software that you want to download uh, to um, enhance the quality of it or change some settings or even do a firmware update, which is awesome. So let's flip over. And I'll, I want to mention, guys, uh, there's a certain software that doesn't work on Mac at the moment, but they'll be coming out here. All right, let's flip it over to the full screen record. Before I do, guys... Um, I want to show you some now on this website here it'll show you some uh, little video clips of the light so right now when I'm speaking to you I can see that light move on the microphone itself and what I do is I turn the volume so it stays in the green I mean if I speak louder it'll go into the yellow and then I dial it down a bit but it's a really cool indicator it's nice uh, to have that live feedback right on your microphone which is pretty cool so um, as we scroll down here Yeti X pretty awesome uh, microphone uh, retails for 169 and uh, yeah this this is the latest and greatest guys for uh, doing your streaming casting unboxings reactions all that good stuff it's pretty sweet so this blue voice broadcast uh, deal right here this is uh, not at the moment working on Mac I think they'll be coming out soon with it but right now it works great on Windows uh, I'm gonna show you at the bottom the software that you need but uh, yeah, smart knob, high-res LED, it's just awesome, guys. This thing has so many good features. Best USB microphone yet. I saw that stuff, and I'm like, I'm in. I gotta have it. Functionality meets luxury in the Blue Yeti microphone X. Absolutely, gotta have it. Buying a house, coming with a car, spouse, with no kids. Yeah. <laughs> Bonafide upgrade. Upgraded version of our favorite mics. Yeti X surpassed the original and ensures blue holes in the crown for many years. See? All this stuff right here, boom, I had to have it. Works with all these great applications. For me, it's going to be OBS. So uh, this is the software you guys can download. Um, so Logitech G Hub here in the blue shir Sherpa, Sherpa, right here. And then uh, you're able to really uh, dial in the uh, the quality of, the, of your mic. A lot of different features here. A lot of different presets of your uh, the way your voice sounds. I won't get into that stuff. Uh, I might later on, but that's that's uh, pretty pretty professional stuff right there. Uh, customizable LED lighting. So you have to download that uh, G Hub uh, software to change the uh, colors here. 
but I'm, I'm cool with the green and red for view units. But you can do it if you want. So it's a nice looking mic, man. This thing is really cool. Got a different picture here. Look at these pictures. Nice. Clean looking, clean looking mic. Yep, got that pop filter. That's kind of what I'm using right now. Fantastic. There's your four polar patterns. What I'm using right now is the carteroid mode. Cart carteroid mode. Right in front. You got the omni all around you, stereo left to right, and the bi-directional front and back. Four capsule canister condenser. Four capsule condenser. That's the most of any mic that I've ever owned. And the more capsules, the clearer your voice will sound and the better it'll sound. High res LED meter, very nice. Multi nub, yep. Multi knob controls, this is great. It just it saves a lot of different buttons and knobs you gotta mess with. Uh, yep, G Hub integration. Yep, pick your things, plug and play. Fantastic. Feel the comparison, guys. We all know about the Yeti. I've owned the Yeti before. I've owned the, the Yeti Nano. I haven't touched a snowball, but look at look at this uh, the specs here, guys. Twenty four bit, right? Standard Yeti don't have that. Checks all the bases here. Four condensers. The most of all of them. Awesome. Yep. A lot of cool applications. Tech specs. Now here's the downloads, guys. So right here is the G Hub download and then the Sherpa download. So the uh, Logitech G Hub it brings you to this website here. That's where you can download for Windows or Mac. Maybe it works for Mac. Who knows? I'm not sure. Maybe it's maybe it's the, the Sherpa Sherpa that doesn't work with Mac yet. I think that's I think this is the one. So this is the one you can do the firmware updates and stuff. This is what I did. Uh, yeah, here it is, right here. So the Yeti X and Blue Voice compatibility for Mac is coming soon. So I downloaded for Windows, and let's pull it up right here. Subcap. All right. So right away, look at this little thing here. Firmware update. How cool is that? So basically, you go up to here to Yeti X. Firmware update. Click. All right, guys, so I just did the firmware update, and uh, as soon as it came back online, I had actually turned down the gain a little bit just because the firmware did something to the, to the mic. And then also now I have an issue where it's not detecting uh, the, the Yeti X, even though my OBS picks it up like what you're hearing right now with my voice. It picks it up fine right now, uh, but it doesn't detect it here. And also with the Logitech G Hub, it gets my both my web cameras and then it, it sees I have a Yeti X but it says it's not connected for so something's going on with that firmware that I just downloaded so I don't know if you guys probably shouldn't update the firmware I don't know what's going on with that but these are the two softwares uh, you can uh, download to get uh, your microphone up and running and tweak in and all that good stuff so that is it guys uh, so I hope you guys like the video it's an unboxing video and just a quick um, you know listen to my my voice with the new mic uh it looks great it sounds great i like the little light light that uh illuminates as i talk so it's nice to have uh, an indication of how my voice is sounding uh, without having to look at my monitor to check out the uh the volume there so um maybe i'll turn up the volume a little bit right now it's still in the green so i can bump it up a little probably otherwise guys thanks for watching this uh, unboxing video like subscribe share appreciate it and you guys check this thing out i'll put a link in the description below if you want to look at it all right, guys, you have a great night. Home Theater Rules. Rafa, let's see ya.